Demonstrating how to tie a classic cat skull split wing using wood duck, you could also use mallard flank or teal for that matter. I'm using a single feather in this instance, you could however use two feathers in order to get a fuller effect. Up until this point we've tied our wood duck in, built up an even thread dam in front of the wing to try to cock it up at roughly 90 degrees. What you end up with looks kind of like a anemic fan wing comparadon effect. From here we're trying to split the wing into two equal amounts, near enough is good enough, no need to count the fibres. I'm using my bodkin to aid in this and my sausage fingers to try and massage the fibres into place. We're now going to take the thread from where it's parked in front of the wing into a cross wrap behind the far wing and the object is to do two consecutive figure eight wraps around the base of each wing to keep it split. I'm going into the first figure eight wrap supporting the far wing with my fingers, nice even thread tension, supporting the near wing going around the base of it. Normally I'd proceed into a consecutive figure eight here, giving myself a little more time in the video. Massaging and supporting the far wing, going around the base of it, going into the second figure eight. The near wing going around it, not releasing your thread tension at any point, nice equal tension. Now we're going to lash hook and wing going into a cross wrap from front to rear, rear to front, support the wing if necessary, equal thread tension going from front to rear and not releasing tension, one last security wrap to keep everything in place. And there we have it, our classic Catskill split wing. I hope it's been helpful.